y'all know for any shower routine we gotta set the vibes so today we're going in with the raspberries and whipped vanilla candle before we get into the shower hey y'all welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is mink and of course this is mink's kinks happy new year as you guys can see we are starting out this year with a shower routine but first things first go ahead hit that subscribe button join our kinky crew fam definitely leave me a comment down below so that i can personally welcome you but yeah let's get into this shower routine because it has been a little minute um but you know since it's the new year there's no better time than to start a new routine than now and one of my goals for this year is radical self-care so let's start talking okay so y'all know I'm going in with Dr. Bronner's today. We're using a peppermint. Um, I've been loving my African net shower sponge situation. Um, you don't have to use a whole lot with the Dr. Bronner's. It's a lightweight exfoliation daily, which I love. I love. I do use the Dr. Bronner's in my nether regions. Yes, every day. And then make sure you get your back. That's one of the best things about this shower sponge is that you're able to get your entire back. We all be fighting for our lives trying to get our back and this makes it so much easier. So now I'm going ahead and rinsing off and I need to shave today. So I'm going in with the EOS um, shaving cream and I'm going in the vanilla scent because today we have a vanilla theme. So I only need a pump or two um, for each of my underarms. When you shave, definitely make sure you are holding the top part of your arm tight so that you get the closest shave. That's a key trick, okay? And can we talk about how light my underarms are? Yeah. Yeah. Let's get into it. <laughs> so one of the key components here is my mask that I make here. It's like a sugar scrub and I use it to lighten certain areas. So I only use this on my underarms and down on my yoni area. Like I said, it's sugar based. There's turmeric. Turmeric helps with um, any dark marks as well as stunting hair growth. So yeah. I've been loving this body wash here, but we're not going in with this one. Um, it's the Olay. It's in like a chamomile aloe. I love the Tree Hut candy cane scrub, but for today we're going in with this KP Duty um, body scrub situation, and she is thick. I was so hurt that piece fell into the tub, y'all. Oh my god. So this definitely is a pricey product. It's definitely a pretty penny, but you're paying for just goodness it's so good a little bit does go a long way um and i love the like grit that it feels on my skin i like a more abrasive body scrub so this has been a game changer for me and then i am actually using this um radiance skincare system from duval and they sent me this almost a year ago and i have been absolutely obsessed so I do have a discount code down below. I'll have to check and see if it still works or not. And I'll try to leave a pinned comment. But as you guys can see, it spins like a facial brush would. But you use this on your body. And when I tell y'all this has been a game changer in my self-care. It's not something that I do all the time. Because, you know, then you got to clean it and all of that stuff. But when I am feeling down or just want to feel bougie, luxurious, this scrubber, oh my god talk about will change your entire routine up and i am still working on the back acne yeah we're still working on it but y'all see how like hydrated my skin looks already with no no product so i decided to go ahead and show you guys again just with my legs because it's very satisfying i don't know why my bathroom was coming up more blue than what it is but you know You guys comment down below a new year resolution that you have set for yourself or a goal anything i'm just curious and then y'all already know what's up i'm going in with the honey pot i know that a lot of the girlies are not feeling the honey pot no more but honestly it feels the same to me and of course it's not a real shower if you're not dancing so the song that's been it got me in a chokehold is snooze by SZA. i'm so obsessed so now that i'm out the shower it is time to get into our post shower and my skin was just looking too freaking good let's not talk about my hair um yeah it's a little crusty it's a little dusty but wash days tomorrow so first things first i go in with this tree hut post shave smoothing mist situation 
um and i really don't think it's a necessary product but i can definitely see the difference when i use it um and i just make sure to pat it in you don't want to rub something like this in okay so y'all know that this is a voiceover and y'all if you're not new to my channel you know that it's a very chaotic place but can we get into how light my underarms are like that scrub be working i'm trying to tell y'all i'm trying to tell y'all like get into how light there's nothing on my underarm except for the spray back to the regularly scheduled video all right so now we're going to go ahead in with this oil here it's the tph anything glows um body collection and we're going to pair it with the brazilian bum bum cream now i'm honestly not that much of a fan of the bum bum cream by itself but pairing these two together first of all tarashi put her foot in this oil like it is just that good it's that good i've used it with so many different scents um it's a nice warm vanilla situation i told you guys that was my theme for today and pairing these two together just made me feel real luxurious the tph oil is affordable but it feels so luxe and i started a new jar of the brazilian bum bum cream so i had to show y'all because how satisfying is that and we're getting it all up off the lid yes ma'am and get into the like subtle soft glow on my skin it looks so freaking healthy so now we're going ahead and we're going to wash her face and this is the youth to the people cleanser um i use this as this is my favorite my favorite moisturizing cleanser um it's just so good a little bit goes a long way it is expensive she's expensive but i think this is an investment um a little bit goes a long way and look at my skin after washing my face like my skin just looks so good and then i'm going in with a mask today i usually steam but i didn't feel like doing all that this is the shea moisture hydrating mud mask and i've had this forever because a little goes a long way and it's a typical clay consistency so you got to do a little bit of work getting it on your face that's why i'm not using the tool but then i'm letting that sit for a little bit and then i'll just come back and rinse it off so yeah you guys that is the end of today's body routine i hope that you guys enjoyed it 2023 is going to be a great year make sure you comment down below something that you're looking forward to a goal and i love you i'll see you in my next one bye